is we're gonna take some construction documents and lay out using your uh, BD SketchUp model so want to make construction layout documents first you have to have your 3d model uh, made in catch up so we'll make sure the model is complete but uh, simple so as not to make it uh, complicated in layout heavy so make sure it's um, set up in different scenes as I have here right now I have scene one for the perspective and scene six that would be your floor plan and seven that's the mezzanine plan and uh, yeah the scenes two three four and five are your elevations okay so once you have set up your views in SketchUp make sure you save save your model and then you send it to layout and right copy let's cut and paste it here so this is a new file this is the 3d model that we have here so just uh, scale the window down to your desired size and then just click and drag and uh, press the control key copy it down right click scale it to 1 is to 100 and uh, use a different scene or scene 6 scale this one is 100 right so control x that's uh, cut and add another page and paste it to the other page so let's rotate this one this will be your floor plan now once you've got your floor plan ready, what you need to do is you just resize the window. Okay, since you've already um, assigned a scale to it, the scale won't resize. But you can actually uh, adjust that here. Do you want to preserve the scale and resize or not? But if it's in ortho graphic mode, leave one scale. Right and uh, drag and copy another scene. So let's do scene two, which is the another scene. This is the that that elevation view, that side elevation view. Then. Copy and drag again. The scene for the right elevation. Then adjust, adjust it. Carefully. Then. drag it down here because we have to add two more views click on control view that's the uh, front view and the rear elevation view that's the front view so as to fit this floor plan and solution. Solution in five. Okay. So basically that's how you put your 3D model into to the orthographic model. Uh, of course you have to change the style here. Make it like construction. Styles, or default styles, and instruction, instruction, documentation style. Okay. 
Okay, so let's remove the background color. And um, yeah, you can get your borders. Copy and paste it so you can create your own um, border style here. So this is for the front page. So you can do this here. And just adjust your drawing so it to fit the borders. Okay? After this, alright, you can change um, the template here. The name, the owner, and the project name here. Edit it. Now, all you need to do uh, this is actually a complete page one for your architectural drawing. So, all you need to do here is you just have to uh, put dimensions in it. So, I can do something like this. Okay. So what I'm doing right now is I'm putting dimensions which is actually uh, interior walls. So that's from inside to inside. Okay. So I do uh, center to center dimensions when I do foundation drawings. So I just adjust. So what you need to do is uh, yeah you dimension you dimension everything uh, floor plan can also dimension the elevation views and yeah you can just from the scrapbook here you can choose let's say elegant for contemporary uh, title block. So this is the floor plan. You just um, edit, edit it out. Fail here is one. one so same thing with uh, this other views. You can dimension it using this dimensions uh, command and just copy this title block there then edit right so basically that's what you need to do um, go for other tutorials later for sectioning and the details other details but basically this is uh, what you need to do in order for your um, 3d model get into